Hi, thanks for stopping by. This is Teresa from Samadels. In this video, I'm showing how I sew flutter sleeves to a bodice. This pattern and many other patterns are available in my online shop. I'd love to see you over there and the link is down in the video description. We will need two front bodies, four back bodies, four sleeves and four collar pieces for this one. Sew the back bodice pieces to the front bodice piece along the shoulder seams. Take two of the flutter sleeve pieces each and sew them together along the curved edge. Clip the curve so that the fabric lies nice and flat once it's been turned inside out. Turn the sleeves inside out and press. Base along the straight edge with a wide stitch. Leave a tail at both ends. Pull the thread from both sides to gather the edge. Only pull on one of the two threads at a time. Pin front and back bodice together along the back and neck seams. Sew 
Sew mane and lining fabric together by starting at the back, going around the neck and around to the back again. Clip the curve so that the fabric lies nice and flat once it's been turned inside out. Pin the flutter sleeves to the arm opening in between main and lining fabric. Sew along the arm opening to sew main and lining bodice and the flutter sleeves together.
cut off any extra bits of fabric. Clip the curve so that the fabric lies nice and flat once it's been turned inside out. Turn the fabric inside out. Close the underside of the armholes. So long here, like this. And there we have our dress bodice with flutter sleeves and a collar as shown in the previous video. I'll link it in the video description down below. And in the next step we're going to attach the skirt. But first we're going to have a look at some puff sleeve options. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked the video and it was useful to you. Please consider supporting me by buying my patterns. Here's a preview of my shop and the link is in the video description. Down there under me should be the link to the next video. And if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos and follow me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. I'd love to see you over there. See you next time. Bye.